OnCourse Learning presents the Masterclass video series. In this session, we will provide an overview of the Student Training Portal. Here we will discuss important topics, including launching a course, viewing your progress, retrieving your certificate, and more. Select a training program. After successfully logging in, you will be brought to the main page titled My Training Programs. Here you will find the training programs in which you are currently enrolled. Review this list to find your desired training program. For this example, we will look at underwriting. Click on the expand icon located in the upper right corner to access the contents of the training program. In this expanded view, you will see the number of required modules, the date that your training program must be completed by, your current progress, a description of the training program, and a list of your courses. Launching a course. After expanding a training program, you will be presented with a list of courses that make up the training program. Find the course that you wish to take within the list and select the arrow to the right, which will launch the course in a new window. Training program and course progression. As you proceed through a course, your progress will be identified within the course window by two progress bars. The first bar shows the progress within the course. The second bar shows the progress within the current section. When you have completed a course, you will be returned to the student portal. Within the student portal, you will be able to see both your training program and course progress. Progress for individual courses can be seen to the right of each course title. When a course has been completed, it will be represented by a black check mark. Disabled Courses During your training, you may encounter courses which are unavailable. These are designated by a gray lock. Moving your cursor over the lock will display the reason that the specific course is unavailable. Often, courses may be disabled because not enough time has passed after completing the previous course, or prerequisite courses may not have been completed. You may need to review your courses again to ensure each module has been finished. Final Assessments Once all the training courses have been completed, the final assessment will be unlocked. Click on the arrow to the right, which will open the final assessment in a new window. Now you are ready to take your exam. In order to complete your training program, you must achieve a passing score on your final assessment. Certificates After completing the final assessment, your certificate will become unlocked. If you would like to view or print your certificate, click on the ribbon icon located in the lower left corner. Accessing Training Program Documents Important documents can be found in the Required Documents section. Here you will find documents such as course scripts or your syllabus. If you click on the download link for your desired document, it will be downloaded to your device and available for printing or viewing. Student Profile To update your personal information, select the Profile menu icon located in the upper right corner of the main page. Choosing Edit Profile will bring you to the User Profile screen. On this screen, you are able to update your information including name, email address, phone numbers, and profession. Make sure you select Save Profile in the lower right corner to save your changes. If you would like to change your password, you may do so by selecting Change Password from the Profile Categories on the right. Here you may enter the new password you would like to use when signing in. Student Transcripts Selecting the Transcripts category on the right side of the Profile screen will present you with your training history. Here you can view all of the training programs you have previously accessed as well as the dates attempted and the time you spent in each course. You will also see whether each course was passed along with your score. Here you may print any certificates that are available. Thank you for joining us in this brief introduction to OnCourse Learning's Student Portal. We hope you enjoy your training.